This is the IPS Beacon 2 device. This is a second generation IPS Beacon. It is a visual alert, uh, data logging uh, capable product. Um, it's designed for class one, div one uh, environments, or zone zero environment, intrinsically safe. Uh, the battery life on this product, uh, four to five years, depending on your read rate and depending on your environment. Uh, if you utilize the optional Bluetooth TAM, which is used to communicate with the IPS Mobile Insight platform, there's a separate battery within the Bluetooth TAM that today is around a two-year battery life, but it's separate. The beacon's going to get four or five years at a five-minute read rate. What it measures is surface temperature and vibration. You can custom configure your thresholds for vibration and for uh, temperature. You custom configure how many readings you want to be averaged. You average the reading compared to the threshold. Basically, the way it communicates from a visual standpoint is through the blinking scheme that we have. If it's blinking red, it means you're outside the threshold. It's made a comparison and it's not happy. So, hey, come look at me. Get maintenance, come look at me and see why is this happening so we can hopefully prevent an unplanned failure, which, are, which can be very costly. From the maintenance perspective, um, via the accelerometer, certainly we're looking at vibration from a, is the vibration too high standpoint, but we're also looking at the vibration of is the equipment running or not running. Generally, when the equipment's not running, the vibration's low, very, very low, right? So we can sense when the equipment uh, is on from vibration, and we can keep a tab of what the runtime is. So that helps in situations where, say you have a six month oil change assigned. The thing is, what happens if it's a pump or a type of equipment, rotating equipment, that only operates four hours a day? Uh, very common within plants. If you can just really want to do it based on a six month schedule of runtime, you can extend out your oil change, which affects multiple things. Costs, certainly, of the oil. The labor to go change that oil. The environment impact of having to dispose of that oil. So this can be a very valuable piece of information that you can get just from a visual alert from a guy walking by.